Today is a day nearly 15 years in the making. Back in 2007, Corey Gaston snatched a 10 year old girl from her bedroom window and sexually assaulted her. Then he was on the run for nearly a decade, but now he's caught for good. Your sexual assault of this young 10 year old girl is not only shocking, but unconscionable. And for that, 43 year old Corey Gaston will spend anywhere from 25 to 50 years in prison for brutally raping a little girl. I hope that you think about the, uh, the dire consequences uh, that you imposed upon this young girl back in 2007. The victim, who is now in her 20s and a mom of her own, watched Gaston's sentencing on Zoom Monday. She didn't speak, but did talk with Fox 2 anonymously shortly after Gaston was captured, hiding out in Mexico more than a decade on the run. I don't have to look behind my car at night. I don't have to be scared no more. June 27, 2007, Gaston was at a barbecue near Pearson Street on Detroit's west side, near where the little girl lived. Investigators say he noticed her, then plotted the kidnapping. He broke into her window, threw her over his shoulder, and out into an alley where he raped her. I remember when he walked into the bushes and told me to keep quiet. I didn't know he was going to take me back home. Thank God he did. He took her back home to retrieve a cell phone he dropped. That and DNA helped police catch him right away. But he made Bond twice, running both times. The latest to Mexico, where he was on the U.S. Marshals' 15 most wanted list before they caught him. Now he'll stay in prison for as long as 50 years. I wish uh, the victim and their family uh, nothing but the best in the future. I do hope you can find your peace in the future. Reporting downtown Detroit, Jessica Dupnak, Fox 2 News.